celebrities. Why do we give them attention? Why is that of that we are focusing on some bimbo or some douchebag? Why do we not focus on problems that actually matter as a species? Why do we focus on people such as the Kardashians or Donald Trump or Kim Jong Un? Why do we not try to work together to make this world a better place instead of playing lip service and saying that we are against some person but we are doing nothing to stop him? I say this not to be mean or something like that. I know we are on, on, on a different journey in life to search or so uh, expand, extend. But there is something we all can. What? What can you do to not? Playing web servers first. We can go. You can go vegan. Yeah, you can. Even if you are poor, I have not so much money, and I'm also can be vegan. And I'm being vegan. I eat for around four euros. Yeah, I can eat two, two days for four euros. Some days um, I can do this. Some can, but most days I eat four euros a day. Not really, but I eat four. <laughs> yes. If you go vegan, you save a lot of water. Exact to be factual, actually, any year. A vegan saves compared to a standard animal consumer in the Western world over 70 years of water. If you are showering not for 70 years, you are stinky troll. You have to you have to spare the same amount of water as that thing in that showers any day for five minutes for one year. For one year. Fee you are not showering. For 70 years, you save the same amount of water as the vegan can in one year. So, that vegan you don't find is far more, even if he does not be aware of it, water that can happen. So, you can have found water party while you are a sweaty stinky guy and he still wastes less water than you in fact we can stop world hunger many times over if anybody go vegan right now 70% of all the food is plant is food for the livestock and around fourteen five percent of all the land mass is used for animal Agriculture.
It takes six to twenty times the amount of land to feed an average Western consumer, American slash European. Compared to a vegan. So that same vegan takes just one six of an acre. But you are carnivores, or I, I mean omnivores. You're carnists. You take three com uh, three point three acres of land. So you waste a lot of food. And why? Now Amazons are protectors. They don't live in the air and water. They are not like plants. I hope you do understand enough of biology to get that fact. I don't know photosynthesis. It takes up from six to twenty-six the amount of plant foods to produce one pound of animal food. So in case of cow flesh, that can be up to uh, 26 An amount of grains, depending on which studies you take, and I think that's static. The lower ones used by animal agriculture are uh, obvious, try to let their industry seem to be less destructive. It's 18. So, sheep are also very uh, cheap, uh, water costing and energy costing. So, why not go here? It costs an extremely amount of harm to animals. Living creatures are just as smart as your dogs and cats. And sometimes even smarter on effort. Why cost unnecessarily suffering? On the moment that I did realize that I don't have to cost unnecessarily suffering to survive. Oh, they were. I never want to cause unnecessary harm. So why do you? Cowardness? Indifference? Apathy? Malice? Are you sadist? Do you also think that the children that die from starvation because their food is fed to livestock is funny? Are you also going to mock them? To let yourself look like an even more bigger hypocrite? It is easy to go vegan. It's serious. It's not the most easiest thing you can do, but it is actually easy. You, can, you go to the supermarket, you buy a bag of bananas. Or you buy a bag with mangoes, bananas, and other fruits, and you take a bag of, of um, rice. Basically, you can live off that <laughs> brown rice and fruit. And if you are not sure about that, take some mountain milk with it. No uh, cows are raped because of uh, the almond industry. And almonds takes uh, almond milk takes uh, three. You can have three 
facts of uh, of almond milk and compare that to the amount of calcium because if you look to the water, water markers, it takes one one thousand liters of water to produce one liter of cow milk, but it takes just three hundred thirty three. liters of water to produce that same liter of almond milk. So either way if you buy almond milk cows are not abused the babies are not stolen away from them. And it is better for the environment. If you are, want to have something that is similar to there, you can also have cocoa milk or hazelnut milk, sunflower milk. There are so many different plant based milks to them. I bet there's some, some of those uh, categories I've mentioned that you want. And if you want to have something that tastes or have a similar texture as um, cow ass, beef, you can eat satan. And by the way, that cow flesh that is also um, smashed and Make tender because that stuff is ta is uh, not tender at all. So they are actually kicking it with um, hammers on it to make it more tender. Yeah, that's what I do. They do also put a lot of salt to it because otherwise you don't like it. They use a lot of chemicals in it so it does not rot. And you get a parasitic affection. <laughs> Serious. Check this uh, aesthetics here out. Uh, around. One. Uh, around three fourths of all the flash in the United States have super bugs. <laughs> So, oh, vegan again. Stop making excuses. Because if you are not a victim, don't imagine it entirely from your point of view. If you have any moral bone in your whole body, watch it from the animal's point of view. How are suffering terribly? More horribly than you can ever imagine. I speak for the animals in the same way that I want to be spoken for if I were in their position. You don't like that maybe, but when your thoughts are prejudicial, how the freak cares about your opinions? When darkness and light become one, the reality spreading away and the truth become visible.